Hello and welcome to this video. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have arrived in South Africa for their 10-day tour of the continent, a picture shows, with the Duchess of Sussex cradling her firstborn, sporting for the occasion an adorable white bobble hat. The family of three touched down in South Africa at 9.45 a.m. British Standard Time or 10.45 a.m. local time and are gearing up to begin their whirlwind tour. Meghan, Harry and Archie can be seen beaming in the first snap, depicting them at the airport, making the start of their tour. In the picture, the trio can be seen leaving the British Airlines overnight flight that took them from London Heathrow to the South African southwest coast. To make the first public appearance in months of Archie even more special, Meghan and Harry decided to make him wear an adorable white bobble hat. The four-month-old was wrapped up in a white blanket and while in his mother's arms looked very much awake and ready to start his first royal tour. In the picture, Meghan and Harry can be seen smiling as they walk to their car, ready to take the Duke and Duchess of Sussex to their first engagement of the day. Upon landing, the Duchess wore a light grey coat and has her hair tied up in a neat bun. On the other hand, Prince Harry wore a light blue jacket, a white shirt and blue trousers. The first picture of the tour sent royal fans into a frenzy, as some eagle-eyed watchers noticed Archie's bobble hat looks very similar to the one worn by his father during a flight with Princess Diana in 1985. This similarly interpreted by many royal fans as a tribute to Harry's late mother has been praised by many on social media. One wrote, love when they channel past looks. Another added, so alike in these pics. Princess Diana will likely be remembered more than once during this royal tour, with Harry travelling to Angola later this week to witness the result of his mother's famous demining campaign. Meghan, Archie and Harry arrived in Cape Town 40 minutes after planned, as their BA flight from Heathrow was delayed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are hitting the ground running, as they are due to arrive in Nyanga in the Cape Flats, just outside of Cape Town by 1pm BST. Meghan and Harry will visit the city known as the country's murder capital, where one in 206 people are killed each year, according to recent statistics, and meet members of charity Justice Desk and learn more about its work. The charity works in the township with the country's highest murder rate, teaching women how to defend themselves from attacks and violence. While Meghan and Harry carry out their first engagement of the day, Archie will remain at their residence with his nanny. Thank you for watching this video for latest in celebrity news. Please subscribe to my channel.